Yo, what's going on Leafer Nation? It's Leafer back again and welcome back to the channel. Today I have my first NHL 24 video for you guys and I'm going to be teaching you guys how to deke in NHL 24. Let's get into it. Alright guys, so I usually do this video every year for you guys, teaching you guys how to deke. Now, there haven't been any new dekes added, but there is a new, there's total controls. It's super new and super easy to do, but regardless, I'm gonna show you guys how to deke with total controls and how to deke with skill stick as well. So hopefully I'm gonna be able to help some of you new players out, some of you old players that are trying to learn some new dekes. Hopefully this video is helpful for, for you guys. And if it is, let me know in the comment section down below. All right, so let's get into it. The first deke I'm gonna teach you guys to do is the backhand tuck. So the backhand tuck looks something like this, super simple to pull off and super clean once you pull it off in game. So what you're gonna wanna do is hold your uh, hold the puck onto your forehand. You're gonna hit LB and RB at the same time and you're gonna tuck it in just like so. To follow up the backhand tuck, you got the forehand tuck. Same thing here, you're gonna hold the puck onto your backhand, LB, RB, and there's the forehand tuck. Super simple deeks to pull off. And to do the one-handed tuck on total controls, all you're gonna do is come up hit and hold and then release A and you get the one-handed tuck on total controls. Next up, we have the backhand windmill. Uh, super simple deke to get around opponents if you wanna cut out to the outside or if you're cutting uh, or you're on the other side of the ice, you wanna cut into the middle, uh, you, you do the windmill. So to do the backhand windmill, you're gonna hold the puck out to your backhand, hit LB and then go out with your right stick to the right and you get the backhand windmill. And after that, you got the forehand windmill. Forehand windmill, same thing. You're holding it to your forehand, hitting LB, right stick to the left, and you pull it off. Obviously, uh, when I'm saying the direction of the stick, it depends what hand in this player you have. I'm using a righty right now. Next up, we got the bank pass. Super simple to pull off. Uh, and it, it's honestly a necessary deke sometimes uh, to you know, try to gain some speed without the puck to get around an opponent. So to do the bank pass, what you're gonna do is hit LB and RT at the same time and you bank it off of the boards. Super simple deke. Next deke after the bank pass, I like to call it the Crosby. It's a bank pass behind the net. Essentially, you're doing the same controls, LB and RT at the same time and you bank it off the net and you get your round to your opponent, drive the net and score a goal. Now we're gonna move on to a more of a complicated deke here. We got the behind the back, looks a little something like this. Lovely deke, man, like super clean. And if you pull it off, man, it's an insane clip. Let's be honest with each other. So to do the behind the back, what you're gonna do is hold your puck out to your forehand. You're gonna hit and hold RB and then rotate your right stick to the left and put your left stick inwards and then both the left stick and right stick go outwards. So you do that and you pull and you pull this stick off. Again, super clean. Now, it does take time to do. It took me so long to get the complicated deeks down, but with practice comes per perfection. Next up, we got the between the legs pass and the between the legs shot. So first off will be the pass. Now, I'm using total controls, so I'm gonna show you guys how to do it on total controls and then show you guys how to do it on skill stick. So for total controls, all you're gonna do is hit B and RT at the same time and bang, not at the same time. Hit B first, then hit RT, and you make the pass. Obviously, aim with the left stick where you wanna pass the puck, and that's where the puck will go. Now, to do it on total controls, what you're gonna do is hold LB and down on the right stick at the same time, and then hit RT, and bam, you pull it off. Now, for the between the legs shot on uh, total controls, all you're gonna do is hit B, and then up on the right stick to get that shot. Again, super simple, B up on the right stick. Now, if you're doing it on uh, skill stick, same thing as the between the legs pass, it's gonna be down on the right stick, LB, and then up on the right stick. I just broke the glass, okay, hmm, NHL 24. Next up after the between the legs pass and shot, we have the Datsuk flip. Again, uh, it's different if you're using total controls to do the flip and the shot. So, to do the flip on uh, total control, what you're gonna do is hit, X and then RB to flip that puck over the goaltender. So X and RB for the Datsuk flip. To do the Datsuk flip on skill stick, what you're gonna do is hit and hold down the right stick and then you're gonna hit RB. Uh, super simple to do on uh, skill stick as well. Now to do the Datsuk shot, what you're gonna do is the same thing. If you're on total controls, you're gonna hit X and then up on your right stick like you're shooting the puck and you get the Datsuk shot. Now to do it on 
skill stick, same thing as a path down on the right stick uh, and then up on the right stick to get that shot. Next up, we have the jump deke, uh, super simple deke to pull off. Honestly, if you're on a breakaway, you see a goaltender try to fly and poke check you, you can just jump right over them, all right? So to do this deke, what you're gonna do is click LB and flick up on your right stick at the same time to get that little jump with the puck. Moving back to the complicated dekes, we got the Kucherov. So this is kind of a two-parter deke. So what you're gonna do is hold LB Hold your left stick out to the left and then your right stick out to the right. Okay, so that's not how you do it, but obviously you gotta do it all in one motion. Bang, bang, and you lose that puck and you try to just slot it five hole on a breakaway. Next off, we got the Michigan. So what I'm gonna do for the Michigan, it is super easy to pull off on total controls. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do it on total controls. Very simple. You're gonna go around the net, you're gonna hit Y, and you're gonna pull off the Michigan, all right? That's all you're gonna do for total controls. Hit Y and you get that Michigan animation. Now, if you're using skill stick, I'm not gonna show you how, you, uh, how to do it on skill stick because obviously it's harder to do, but I'm gonna tell you guys how to do it. So to do the Michigan on skill stick, you're gonna hold the puck to your forehand. You're gonna hold down LB. You're gonna then hold in your right stick, then rotate your right stick to the left and then to the right. Now, if you're doing the Michigan on skill stick, the big thing to take in with that is Timing is key on this. If you hit the perfect timing, you will pull up the Michigan, but it is very hard to do. Next off, we got the lacrosse pass. I call it the Zgris. Crazy move. So to do it on total controls, again, super simple. You're gonna go behind the net. You're gonna hit Y. This time you're gonna hit RT at the same time and you flip that puck up. Y and RT to get that pass animation off of the Michigan, all right? Now to do the Zgris on skill stick, again, I will explain to you guys how to do it because I'm sure a lot of people are still using skill stick. So to do the Zgris on skill stick, you're gonna hold your puck to your forehand, you're gonna hold down LB, then hold in the right stick, rotate the right stick to the left, then to the right, and then hit RB to pass, or I think it's RT, my mistake, but yeah. It's gonna be hard to do on skill stick, let's be honest with each other here. Total controls, you hit a couple buttons, and it's doing it for you. Next up, we got the one touch deke, so one touch backhand and the one touch forehand. So first off, to do the backhand, what you're gonna wanna do is hit LB, and then you go out with the left stick at the same time, and you will produce a little something like that to just kinda get around someone. Uh, it, it's super effective to be honest. And then the one touch forehand, same thing, LB, but this time with the left stick, you're going out to the left, all right? Something like that. Next up, we got the skate kick. Looks a little something like this. Uh, honestly, I don't really use it a lot, but it does look clean if you can string it together with some other deeks maybe. So it's simple to do. For the skate kick, all you're gonna do is hold down LB, and then at the same time, you're gonna go down with the right stick, and you're gonna kick that puck just like that. So the next deke we have is the through the legs deke. So to do this deke, you're gonna hold your puck to the forehand, hit LB, and then rotate your right stick to the left. And when you do that, it's gonna look a little something like this. So next up, we have the toe drag. Everyone knows what the toe drag looks like. It, it's honestly a very simple move to just sidestep an opponent. So to do the toe drag, you're gonna hold your puck up to, the, to your forehand, and then you're gonna rotate your right stick to the left, and obviously it'll pull it off. Next up, you have the toe drag shot. Like the toe drag, hold your puck to the forehand, rotate your stick to the left, and then flick up for the shot, and you get a little toe drag shot. Next up, we have the Kyle Turris. So to do the Kyle Turris, what you're gonna wanna do is hold your puck to the forehand, you're going to hit and hold LB, and then go down with your right stick, and it'll produce a move like this. And then last but not least, we have the Zetterberg. I absolutely love this deke. When I pull it off, man, I don't know. It feels amazing. So this is what the Zetterberg looks like, if you guys do not know super like i just love this deke so much it's probably one of my favorite deeks in the game so to do the zetterberg what you're going to want to do is hold your puck to your backhand you're going to hit and hold lb go outwards with both sticks and then inwards with both and you'll will and then you will produce the zetterberg deke just like so anyways guys that is going to be it for this nhl 24 deke tutorial video hopefully i was able to help some of you guys out uh and and learning some new deeks to pull off in the brand new game that has just dropped so if i was able to help you guys be sure to drop a comment down below uh and let me know if i was able to help you uh if you're also new around here make sure to hit the subscribe button down below i have a lot of cool content coming out for uh the entirety of nhl 24 a couple cool hut series some eshl series franchise mode series so if you guys are into stuff like that be sure to drop 
a sub down below and be sure to like the video as well to let me know i was able to help you but anyways guys that is it for today's video thank you guys very much for watching and i will see you guys very very soon talk to you guys later peace